How long has 3D printing been around where, like, as far as where it could come into more of the consumer market? So it, it's been it's been around for a while. Um, I think it kind of goes in, in spurts. I, I think what we saw when, um, you, you know, sometimes there's a need that pops up. I mean, COVID's a, a good example, right? Um, you know, there was this need for, for masks early on mm -hmm. during the pandemic. And, you know, people with their 3D printers were just, you know, they were printing these masks out at home um, to hmm. really try to fulfill that need. You know, and then people were stuck at home during during the pandemic. Sure. You know, we want to hone up on a, on a new skill, you know, a new technology. Uh, so, you know, people were learning different softwares. They were learning, you know, maybe they were taking more time to, to educate themselves on something they didn't know yeah. previously. And 3D printers kind of, that was kind of a little boom during that during that time because people were, were were interested you know they had the time to to learn and, and like anything it's just getting started right like the moment that you know they turn on the printer uh, that's the hardest part sure like turning the power button on yeah it's usually the hardest part uh and then the rest of it just goes downhill from there because you know you start to see the you know the capabilities you, you find out oh it's not as hard to operate as i thought it was yeah be. Yeah, I think that holds people back is that that fear.